Frank. This is what you get when you talk back. You got no arms. You can't retaliate. Why won't you learn? You can't fight back. So don't put up one in the first place. Ah! You don't give me shit. You don't get shit. Uh, can you just buy merch so I don't scar him more seriously? He's only got one face and it's already half goddamn gone. Do you see this? This is the price you pay when you don't get the merch. I need to lift him up so you can see it. When you don't get up. Oh. For a man with no arms or lower half, the boy sure does weigh a bit. Cut the match! Hey, Brett. Right. You know Revelations, right. 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 Revelations, right. 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 Revelations. 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 How would you look at that? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm allergic to sarcasm. Well, I guess I should probably, you know, crack on and play this also. Am I insane for seeing a scythe silhouette? Let me use a new run. Let's play as Dante. Oh, boy. Hope I got some sick jokes that can burn some enemies, because then we got Dante's Inferno. Eh? Oh, and I have a, a pop-up in a mod <laughs> telling me the information. Triple <laughs> A games don't even have their patch notes in-game, but a mod does. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the professionals being put to shame yet again. Beat Glacier, beat Tone, beat my- This is like a full-on rework of the game. Who the bloody hell needs repentance when you got this? Wow. Good job, developer. Why am I, like, slapping a book every now and then? What am I missing here? I, 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 I think I'll just figure this out as I go. Oh, God. Oh, why are the- <laughs> What's with the, uh, with the wonderful little, little stony goblin there we got in a chest? What? Oh, God! What? Uh, uh, what? I have a, what is happening? What is under the ragamuffin? Why do I have Monstro's long shots without having to charge? What the- So I'm doing two floors at once. <laughs> Okay then, this is something like, again, this is its own game. Don't let the label mod confuse you, this is not a mod. This is a full-on reimagining and reworking of the entire concept of this game. Alright, now I see why people were relentlessly telling me this is out. Because it's not as if it's just a little bit of another floor, this is a whole new game. Dear creator, editor, put him on screen. Thank you! Why is there an onion in a bloody display cabinet? I do apologize for taking so long to get to this, but hey, better revelate than never. Also, why am I an old man with my current hairline on one life? But I'm some weird, eyeless creep with a Bane headset mask on another. Oh, I've got to shoot in the same direction to get my damage up. Oh, I see clearly now. Wait, I can meet up with my guy? Because I could see him now, the, the other side of the map. What happens if I meet up in the middle? Here we go, walk to the middle, break the... <clears throat> walk up, oh, there it is. <laughs> scared the life out of me. Okay, so with my damage... Ow. Modifier. I guess what I've got to do is make sure that I keep shooting in the same direction. Shin. I forgot about that. How did I forget about that? And yeah, not change direction, otherwise I lose my damage. Well, that means constantly wasting like 90% of my shots. This is nightmarish. Oh, and a monster! Oh, and a giant fire. That's probably a little bit more pressing. Oh, and a Dr. Fetus! Oh, and a psychic clap! That escalated quite rapidly. That was like Willy Wonka's elevator. That, okay. <laughs> I just fired right out of the ceiling and I don't know where I am anymore. Well, <laughs> let's give that another college try. And this time, let's try not to die. <gasps> Hallelujah. Oh, the... oh, for a second, I thought the doors opened permanently then. I was so happy. <laughs> oh, well, I have more damage. Does it transfer to this character as well? Nope, his damage is his damage. His curse is his own. Was I not meant to have spawned next to the boss room in that case? That's not a guarantee. I thought it was some weird gauntlet thing where I had to go, I could do a shuttle run with this character back and forth to do the boss. Meanwhile, the other one just got resources. Which, by the way, the fact that it isn't that, I'm not bothered with, but, you know, don't, don't lie to me. That would be an alright concept, wouldn't it? Oh, what on earth. Fact of Radiance. Now I've got my warmth. I shouldn't have done this, should I? Ah! Oh, Lord. Huh? Ooh! Nailed it. You will never see a more flawless run of a gimmick like that again from me. That 
is the peak. I say after getting hit like five seconds later. Steam sale on sale, you say. But there's two daggers there. Oh, my heart breaketh for Brett no no not to do. Please give me two coins. Well, I... Don't think that's ever gonna happen again in a million years. It's a good thing that the thing that's in this didn't go on sale, and now I've suddenly realized that the deposit box with the lights on the side looks like a silly face. I finally found the item room, okay? You can't- no! You can't take this from- FOR THE LOVE OF GOD WILL SOMEONE GET SOME FIRE NEAR ME! The, the, the award for least favorite room of life goes to this! I'm gonna go with hearts, because lord knows I need it. Thank you. I now- I now get to- Oh wait, no, I get to get both? Oh wait, no, I get it. It's it's meant for multiple characters. It's it's meant so you can give one to each or double up. And honestly, given the gimmick of this guy, I definitely don't regret giving two to him. Oh wait, no. Because my eyes have also gone with the dynamo. Or is that just a- Not meant to happen? Oh no, I've got to go through here again. Oh, I hope I don't find seven coins and then I get to go back. Uh, ah! Uh, <laughs> oh! Oh! This game did everything I ever requested made it a whole new concept, and made trap rooms actually cruel. I requested it, I got it, and I hate it. I don't actually hate it, I'm just salty that once again I threw it away for absolutely buggering nothing. I had good items, I got the freaking small rock, and now what do I have? I'll tell you what I've got, regret. Resentment for myself, oh, for Christ's sake, Brett. This is like an exam, there's nothing but questions. <laughs> like, why did I do that? Oh, and should I do this? No, I should not have done. This is the room where I die. I die from things that fart. I die from farting. <laughs> I walked in to a flying ass and I died. I walked in to its cushy little buttocks and I'm dead. This character is an enigmatic nightmare. <laughs> Mainly because I'm like the hit single from Michael Jackson. I'm bad. I'm never going to make it past this, am I? I'm going to be stuck playing this one floor for about three years before I realized some very obviously telegraphed feature that would make this easier for me. I don't want to die. No one wants to die. Why would I say that as if that's anything unique? Please be health up. And drowsy. Oh yeah, that's significantly better. That's an improvement on my situation. I'm gonna actually OD on pills. I found one of the item rooms. Who's betting this is where Brett dies? Remember last time where I found the item room and there was two item rooms right then and there and then I died? Oh, I'm calling it even though there's half as many reward. I guarantee that there's just as much chance of failure. <gasps> Hallelujah. <gasps> Hallelujah! And I've got this too. Look up an explosion expertise. Good thing that gave me bombs, isn't it? Mm, that's fantastic. I'm loving all this explosive that I've got. I've got I'm the expert of nothing! I'm losing my mind. I've lost it. It's gone. Ah! This losing damage for not shooting in the same direction is getting me killed because I'm a stubborn moron that refuses to lose damage. You know, as opposed to the more precious thing like health. No, I'll have my damage be high when I'm in the grave. That's what matters. What is this? Seventh attempt? It's lucky number seven. No, it's fine. <laughs> it's not as if the seed of this particular run summons me up perfectly. Ah! <laughs> really loving the ice physics with the wibbity wobbity god damn ping pong flippers. Wait, ping pong? Pinball? <laughs> god, my brain's going again. Why didn't I go back for that half a heart? Why didn't I go back for that half a heart? Why didn't I do that? This room doesn't end. This room actually never ends. Oh my Christ! Please, stop spawning! Please drop me money. Thanks, dude. I appreciate you. What's this do? Well, that's the outcome I was hoping for. Oh, I could do that, though. If he call freak, ask backwards. Now I do double damage and I shit out my asshole. It just suddenly dawned on me that I was saying that my damage goes down. My, my damage, when that's just the range. If you're wondering if Brett feels stupid right now, 35 minutes into this recording saying the same thing wrong the entire time, well, let's just say it's fitting I found what I did. Because now this character is able to fire out of his rear end, or be coming out of my front end this entire time. Oh wait, no, what am I saying? That's probably a usable. That's why you can't buy that, you tit. You can't replace the usable. God, I'm stupid. Also, my face. If that doesn't just sum up how I felt this entire time, being beaten down in the dirt this entire, entire failure of an adventure. Well, boy, howdy, I don't know whatever will. Okay, I'm here. Can I reunite? Now I have a shield. 
and I shoot the wrong way. I actually have a character that is constantly shitting in my face. The goal should be to reunite these characters every time. Never forget, Brett, that's the gimmick. And don't forget to hit L to realign him. Oh my god, this is a Christmas miracle. This character is more complex than any goddamn high-level education could possibly try to be. Also, did our hearts combine when we met? Oh, that's just precious. <sighs> this week, might I remind you, by the way, assuming you've paid attention to the schedule, was supposed to be the fun broken one for me. And it's not! Anything being broken is my smile! <laughs> okay. Oh, music box. What's it do? It probably lures the enemies toward it, doesn't it? And I just spent it in the shop. At least it was pleasant to listen to, though. That's what I'll tell myself after wasting a perfectly good item. Oh, hello, Duke of Flakes. I've got some flakes of my own. You like them? Uh, these ones are rich with fiber, or at least they were to begin with to explain how much I'm doing this. And Frost Rider. Oh my god, I'm terrible. Oh, for the love of lords. Oh, god. okay, I'm just gonna use the Empress. I'm gonna hope that I can poo on him quicker than he murders me. There you go, got his eyes off. I meant head off. I don't know how I said that. There's something wrong with, with mine. Okay, we're good. We're safe. There's PJs. We get to live another day. Quite a few days now I think about it, was it? Little Frost Rider. Oh. <laughs> That's adorable, actually. Oh, I, I will have to say that the involuntary vomiting of an entire object might not be quite as nice. Oh, we've been separated again! I should have seen that coming, I don't know why I'm surprised. What is this? Why does it feel like my brightness got- what the hell? The corners of the room are doors! The corners of the room are doors! Oh, I had to blow up all of the rocks, I think. <laughs> I think. Are those ragman spiders? Just chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool? I hate them. And I've given them life. <laughs> I have myself to blame for this. And only myself. How much health do they have? Remember, 6.75 damage and multiple projectiles. They are still alive. It's as if the developer of this thought to himself, what does Brett hate the most? Whack-a-moles and ragman? One floor's nothing but whackers! And second floor's nothing but raggers! I gotta stand on the fleshy mound. Oh, I'm actually going to commit suicide. Okay, this entire floor's gimmick! I'm gonna die! This entire floor's gimmick is Ragman. This entire floor's gimmick is Ragman. And oh, there he is. Great, that's not- that's- uh, mm, um, I'm dead. I am dead. Gobble me up! This might actually be, for me at least, because I'm god-awful. And get to be fair, <laughs> the items that I kept getting did not help my situation. This might be the most challenging content I've ever played. And it really shouldn't be, it shouldn't be that hard, but when I'm playing it, oh my lord, it is. I can't deflect. I've got to reflect on the situation with this mirror gimmick. Given that the first floor needs to chill out, and the second floor is filled with Rackman, I can now safely say I am equally mortified, terrified, and mummified. Why won't you die? <laughs> Like this video, subscribe for more, and watch the video linked. As you can probably tell, this is going to be a goddamn series in and of itself that's going to be a journey from hell to, well, probably to another hell. So if you liked it and you're looking forward to it, let me know down below and do whatever you want with the, the productivity of this video, liking, sharing, and all that jazz. And thank you to the patrons for supporting the shit show, and to the VIP specifically. Thank you to David Beasley, Surface Munster, The Hernies Man, Casey McClara, AJ, DJ Kitty, King of Ember, and E. Magnus Hahn. Really appreciate you all. See you in the next one. Thank you for being here for this one.